Also Fan TV, it's episode 10 of Predictions. Yes. Ah, it's all hotting up, isn't it? It's all hotting up. Last few games, um, four and five games to go in League Two. <sighs> Lake Orient topping the tree, Northampton and uh, Stevenage back in the top three. Yeah. Um, Stockport, Carlisle, Bradford and now Mansfield make up the top seven. Um, weekend's games, um, Carlisle couldn't beat Northampton. Stockport couldn't beat Gillingham. Mansfield couldn't beat Grimsby. Um, good week for Bradford. They were certainly picking up and Stevenage back on it, of course. Yeah. Um, the win for Bradford, they've got um, a game in hand on Northampton in second and they're just three points adrift with a better goal difference. It's all getting very tight, doesn't it? So um, Bradford, who were <laughs> sort of seventh, um, now sixth, and um, they could still finish top three. Uh, Mansfield, who was struggling to get into the top seven, that win, uh, beating Grimsby, um, gets them in seventh with a game in hand on Salford, who are eighth. Um, they're up 66 points, so I think they're not going to squeeze into the top three, but um, looking a better bet for the uh, the top seven. Um, Barrow slipped up again. Um they failed to win. Yeah. Um, yeah, they know uh, four points behind Mansfield in seventh, and Mansfield got a game in hand. So um, the final, the a final push, and somebody breaking into the top seven, um, doesn't look like it's going to happen. Um, as I say, the results of the weekend were not bad. Really, some strange ones. Um, Barrow failing to beat uh, Swindon as sort of. As I say, put paid to their storm trying to get in. And um, we won't talk about Warsaw at Crew because that was woeful. Woeful. Stevens, no words. so upset he's changed to last year's top. I oh, know because that's how it's going so far. The season um, is going like last season. We need to change it. We thought um, Mike Flynn was going to get fired, and um, Daryl Clark got fired oh, yeah. instead. Um, just looking very briefly before we go on to our predictions, let's uh, look very briefly at uh, League One. Port Vale, 18th place, 46 points, six points clear of the bottom four. Cambridge got a game in hand. Um, and Port Vale have got a difficult running. Um, I think they'll probably be okay because uh, Oxford... Um, and Cambridge need to uh, get plenty of points, yeah. and I think that's probably going to be tough for them. Um, we'll have a look at Premier. Should we have a look at the Premier League as well? Might as well. Um, Leicester. Interesting. Leicester, yeah. who um, <clears throat> we thought would certainly pull out of it, uh, are right in the mire, aren't they, Stephen? What's your thoughts, yeah. Premier League at the mini? I think it's anyone's game, really. I think. Um, well, I want Arsenal to win the league, but I think City are going to come through and pull it. City through. have pulled. They've got a game they've in hand. They've got a game four, in hand and four, four points adrift. So. And guess who they play next week? Arsenal. Arsenal. So, well, week after. Um, how about Villa? Villa trying to get themselves. Villa is sixth. I know I where can't Brighton it. got some games in hand. Deny Emery, man. He's, uh, they've from. done all right, Villa. Yeah. But uh, down the bottom, Forest. Um, Leicester, third from Southampton. bottom, Leicester second from bottom. Southampton are pretty much gone, I think. I don't want to believe it that yet, though. <laughs> I'm, uh, <laughs> Stephen I'm a... has a bit of a liking for Southampton for I... some reason. I don't I know do. why. Because they remind me of Warsaw. <laughs> they remind me of Warsaw. What yeah. getting relegated? That's uh... <laughs> what. Well, except from this season, because <sighs> like Southampton are usually a team which just like start the season really good and then just flop. So yeah, I thought Southampton was a good fit in. Um, but anyway, I think Southampton are going to pull out of it, to be honest. I know I it's think, a mad one. I think you're dreaming, mate. Uh, I've got seven games to go. So se seven games know. to go, four points off. Well, four or five points off. They could do it. I think I can see Leeds going down. So I, I would like to go down. Le uh, Leicester, Forest and Leeds. I don't think Everton will. because Everton, Sean Dyche is going to sort them out, I think. Yeah, so I think they'll be fine there. But I just hope Southampton will We hope so. Out. We hope so for the Toffees. They're in the sticky stuff, the toffees. Um, might be able to pull out of it. Uh, Liverpool, 6-1. Um, yeah, that was a Beat Leeds. That 
uh, Liverpool. They've obviously had a not had a great season, but they're starting to starting to catch up. Um, got a game in hand on Tottenham, only six points adrift of them. Yeah. So uh, they might have a say in the top six. Um, still, about that. Right yeah. then, let's get back on to our main stuff. Mm -hmm. um, Carlisle Stockport tonight. <sighs> this is a big one. It's like a playoff game already. It Carlisle is. Stockport, the winner, could get automatic promotion place. I'm saying Carlisle, but then they have dropped off, haven't they? Dropping Carlisle. down to fifth, Stockport fourth. Yeah, Carlisle um, only won one of the last six. Yeah. Um, Stockport won three of the last going six. Going well, three. going well, Stockport. I think yeah. Stockport might actually win that. On our predictor, we did have um, Carlisle to win that. Yeah. But um, I think Stockport might uh, spring a surprise there. Um, Corley Colchester, a draw. Gillingham, Leighton Orient. Gillingham did well the weekend, didn't they? Yeah. Um, but I'd like Norian to win that, I think. Grimsby Barrow, I think that's going to be a draw. Yeah, solid draw. We've got the same, haven't we, for all of these? Yeah. Uh, Harrogate Warsaw. We did put Warsaw to win 3 1. We've got Warsaw to win 3 1, but with uh, Flynn still in charge, I imagine tonight it's going to be. Ultra defensive. Ultra defensive, same game. I think Harrogate's are probably going to win that. Yeah. Um, as sad as it is to say. Um, Newport Mansfield away win, but you've got home win, haven't you? I thought Newport pull it back. Newport, they've had some good results recently. Mansfield, they're yeah. uh, in seventh. Can I mean, they Newport, hold on? If Newport win that, I think Mansfield have definitely scuppered their chances of uh, getting a promotion place. I'd say. Yeah, well, they're not going to get place. top three. They're not going to get top three, but no. I think. But we're not very happy with Mansfield. Obviously, what happened with uh, Danny yeah. Johnson. Yeah. So, um, past of the past, we, we, uh, we wish them not well. <laughs> yeah. uh, Rochdale, Tranmere, I've got a draw, you've got Rochdale, another win. Yeah, Rochdale, I'm saying I'm going to pull out of it, to be honest. You think so? I think it's a, a mad prediction, but... Let's uh, let's just check the league again. Down the bottom there, Rochdale, eight points adrift with four games to play. Anything is doable. They could do it. It could be doable. They could do it. Harrogate, who got Warsaw tonight... Only Four three points, points. Only three points clear of the drop. Yeah. With the game in hand. If we beat Harrogate, that'd be class. Because then I'd go down. And my prediction would be right. If Harrogate win, um, that potentially potentially puts them safe. Yeah. So it's a big game for them. Um, Salford Hartlepool. Salford slipped off it a little bit, but I think Salford will win tonight. Stevenage Doncaster. Stevenage seemed to be back on it, so we uh, got a home win. Sutton Northampton. I've gone for one one I have. Yeah, Sutton have drifted off a bit really, sort of uh four win four defeats and two draws in the last six. Well that's as bad as Warsaw that is. That is um a bit of a capitulation. Yeah. Um so I think Northampton will probably do that. Swindon Bradford, you've got home win. Yeah. I've got away win. Bradford certainly are doing okay at the minute. <sighs> But uh, let's see. Right then, Wolves Fan TV, predictions. What do you think? It's a big night tonight. I've thought about it. We're going to do live stream watch along. So we'll uh, keep an eye on the Warsaw game. We are. And um, we'll keep an eye on the uh, bottom of League One as well. Three key games there. So uh, we'll see what happens with that. Right then, thanks for watching. Champion. Yeah.